The Hamilton County Board of Elections has now been drawn into the hardball politics of a local congressional race. It all stems from an election commission complaint against Clerk of Courts Aftab Purval, who is challenging longtime incumbent Steve Shabbat for Ohio's first congressional seat. Local 12's Joe Webb joins us with the latest. Joe? Well, Rob, Ohio's Elections Commission will hear the complaint tomorrow that claims Purival used some money from his Clerk of Courts campaign for expenses in his congressional race. You can't do that. Here's the new wrinkle. The memo line on four checks written by Puravall's campaign were redacted, marked out, by the Hamilton County Board of Elections. That's why they called a special meeting of the board this morning. Deputy Director Sally Crissel explained that she redacted the memo lines on the checks after a meeting with Sarah Toppy of the Puravall campaign. Sarah asked me whether Ohio election law prohibited redaction of the memo line on a check that was part of a candidate's filing. Crystal says she used a marker to black out the memos, but wishes she had just handed the marker to Toppy. The campaign has been a bitter war of words between Shabbat and Purival. The meeting today had an edge. Our involvement um, as a board, uh, the, you know, the, the deputy director of this board being involved and what clearly to me is an effort to hide the fact that Mr. Purival was using county campaign funds for his federal account is highly relevant to what we do. Both sides were represented at the hearing. Shabbat's people even had a TV crew taping it. A lawyer for Purival's campaign provided copies of the checks before they were redacted. And the line on the $16,000 check in question says, poll balance and is written to GBA Strategies. Their homepage says winning congressional races across the country. The lawyer explained. Polling can be done for both races. And there's no, there, there's no, there's no law that prohibits running for two, for two uh, uh, offices at the same time. And that's, what, that's exactly what's happening. AFTAB's running for a federal office and for re-election. And is that, poll for the federal, is that poll for the federal race? It's for both races. After about an hour, Board Chairman Tim Burke adjourned the meeting, acknowledging the campaign issue was not really a Board of Elections issue. We can argue whether or not that's a correct statement that occurred on their campaign finance report. That's what Mr. Shrive is arguing before the Ohio Elections Commission. It's not an issue for us to wrestle with today. Now, that meeting before the Ohio Elections Commission is set for tomorrow morning. In a statement released this afternoon, Aftab Purival says he did not know about the redaction and says nothing is more important to him than transparency. He also says he is confident the issue will be resolved in his favor. Rob? Joe Webb, thanks very much. The complaint will be in front of the Elections Commission for what is called a preliminary review. Lawyers for both sides will be on hand to clarify what they've already submitted in writing. The Commission could rule tomorrow or set the complaint for another hearing if they need more information.